Good morning, everyone. To Colonel Bill Robertson, to Lieutenant Colonel Cal Fritz, to Roger Monroe. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, for giving me the opportunity to come before you today. Standing before this Veterans Memorial is a humbling experience, especially on this day, December the 7th. Pearl Harbor Day. When I think of veterans, I think of sacrifice and I think of service. Service is important to me. To give of ourselves for the great and just cause, which is distinctly American. As veterans, we serve and we serve with pride. I am proud to have served as a member of the 101st Airborne Division, 2nd Airborne Battle Group, Rakasa, a Guardsman, and a Reservist. Three times I've had the great opportunity to serve this country, and I serve with honor, pride, and distinction. We shall never forget what it is to make that makes America so special. That willingness to serve, but with service, come sacrifice. We have three special heroes from Creed Corps who made the ultimate sacrifice to fight for our freedom. George Auburn, Jr., United States Army, Iraq. Chris Walker, United States Army, Iraq. R.J. Newton, United States Marine Corps, Afghanistan. These three heroes were killed in action. Their families are here today and I want to say to them, I am sorry for your loss. We share your pain and your grief. We are a family. We will not forget you, and we will not forget your loved ones who gave their lives for America. As a veteran, I remain committed to service. While I no longer been able to jump out of perfect good airplanes, I still believe that everyone should dig deep within them to find a cause that's going to help this great country to remain the country that we presently enjoy. As veterans, we served out a proud, we, as veterans, we serve out of a profound sense of duty and patriotism. We did not serve for name recognition. The call to serve continues with me. I've had the great pleasure of being the coach and founder of an internationally known gymnastic team called the Jesse White Tumblers. For 51 years, we've been in existence. This program has been designed to help our youth find the path to success. And it's why I remain excited and humble to serve as your Secretary of State. As former President Ronald Reagan said once, some people wonder if they've ever made a difference in life. Veterans don't have to make that decision. They do not have to answer that question because they have served this country with honor, pride, and distinction. This memorial pays tribute to the service and to the sacrifice of all of our veterans. You are heroes. God bless you. God bless America. And do all you can to continue to make a difference in this wonderful society of ours and this great country of ours. Remember my philosophy of life as you leave here today, and that is to do something good for someone every day. And remember the heroes who have given their lives in the sacrifice of this great country of ours. Thank you.